you know we're better together, is part of the chorus of the World Cup Qatar 2022 theme song. You might say it's also the mantra of Qatar as it works to overcome logistical challenges to hosting the first World Cup in the Middle East. It's turned to neighboring countries to help with one of the most pressing, ensuring there's enough accommodation for all fans. Qatar's vision for this tournament has always been that it is one for the entire region. After all, this is the first World Cup in the Middle East and the Arab world. And together, we have the opportunity to share the best of our culture and traditions with fans across the globe. With less than six months before players take to the pitch, many hotels are still under construction in Qatar. Finding a place to sleep remains a concern for the one million fans expected to attend Qatar 2022. The organizing Supreme Committee has allocated 130,000 rooms in hotels, cruise ships and desert camps. That does not include rooms available for rent in villas and apartments by private landlords, though no one has been able to provide an estimate of how much additional accommodation that could provide. Qatar Airways has announced a partnership with airlines in neighboring Gulf states to provide same-day shuttle service to attend matches. Fly Dubai, Saudia, Kuwait Airways and Oman Air will fly in 12,800 fans to Doha a day. More flights are expected. I know people are using this against my country. We are not unique where accommodations will be uh, in short supply because the volume in every FIFA, even if it is in a big country like South Africa, like Russia, like anywhere else, there has always been a shortage of accommodation. So we are not unique. Organizers say what is unique is the Arab heritage and hospitality that will offer fans a once in a lifetime experience. Natasha Ganem, Al Jazeera, Doha.